We got Samantha Bush of NC State, three-time national champion now. Yes. How, how are you feeling at the moment? I'm feeling great. Uh, third one's definitely, honestly, the best right now. <laughs> yeah, was this the hottest one, you think, for you guys? Um, I think Tallahassee was a little hotter. Why? Heat-wise, you're saying? Oh, no, just like the hottest one to win for the okay. team. Oh, hardest. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. I can't. No, the accent, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll say hottest, um, Tallahassee, but hardest? Yeah. Yes, for sure. We just had a lot of uncertainty um, with probably most of the people who lined up, especially like me, Amaris, Kelsey. Um, yeah. When did you guys learn that Kelsey wasn't running and how difficult was that for you to take emotionally and to refocus? We knew like, I mean, like last week around some time and it was tough, but honestly, I think everyone, like the coaches really like said it calmly to like, we all were like, we can still do it. It's fine. Yeah. Like, there's nothing to be done. So we just got to go out there and do it. And your race today, can you tell me about your strategy? And also, like, were you aware of how close it was throughout the race? Um, yeah, like, while I was racing, everyone was like, you need to catch, like, this many people. Or, like, you're winning. You got you to gotta do it. You got to go. Um, I mean, I started out pretty far behind, which I usually do. But this time, it was more than usual. So I was just, like, trying to pick off as much people as I could and um, this year I was coming in like a little less confident than the years prior just because like I'm coming back from injury so I uh, I just was trying to like keep myself under control and go for it yeah how did you stay how did you not panic or were you panicking when you're um, that far back early honestly I feel like I didn't panic that much just because I can like see my teammates like I was racing with Grace and I can see like people ahead so that always calms me down like I was r running with Grace um, Harmon she's a sophomore like most of the race like we were going back and forth so I think that kept me calm and what was your injury and when how much time did you miss when did you get back to running I had like a little like hip a glute and like hamstring tendinosis for outdoor season mm -hmm. that ended my outdoor season and like basically the whole summer was just like trying to get it strong to I started running um like at the beginning of the season so I could make sure I was like peaking at the right time and like not furthering the injury yeah so so you're back like maybe August you're training again or when um, roughly yeah, like September, August was like full training. I mean, it was just like a little, I did a really gradual build. Mm -hmm. So that's why like mm -hmm. the beginning races weren't that well. <laughs> yeah. And but I trusted the process. Hennis is very like a slow builder just so you don't get injured again. So it just took me some time. Yeah. And Caitlin sounds like she was under the weather today. She really had to fight the last, the end of it. Yeah. Like, did you see her afterwards or what does it mean for her, for her to be leading you guys to this title? I mean, it means a lot. Like last K, I kind of saw her um, not doing as well as she usually does. And I was like, I have to fight for her because this is going to be hard. Like she's fighting. And I knew that she felt a little sick and I knew she wasn't feeling well. So yeah, when we finished, she was really, really excited and like, you know, really emotional that we won. And then she was like kind of passing out because she felt sick. So that's kind of inspirational. Like she's still really, really happy, and even with her feelings. <laughs> yeah. You crossed the finish line, you're obviously exhausted, but then at what point did you, I guess, realize that you guys have pulled it off? Um, honestly, well, during the whole race, it was like you have to catch five people, like you have to catch as many people, and like I thought I did that, so I was like, okay, I think we won. If I, if they told me that all I had to do was this, and I finished with Leah and Amaris, and that, that's when I had a really good idea. Like they always say, like when you finish with your teammates, like, like all three of us were in a good position, so I had a pretty good idea that we did well. What did Coach Hannah say? I guess when she huddled you guys back up, you know, afterwards. Just like you guys got it done. I. Like, I don't know. I believed in you the whole time. Three peat. <laughs> I don't know. It's just like normal stuff. She was actually pretty emotional. She usually is not. <laughs> Congrats. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank Thanks. You.